Sounds like a good idea. One way presidential candidate Donald Trump says he'd lower health care costs is to let people buy insurance from other states. We should have gotten rid of the lines around each state so we can have real competition. He's not the only Republican to support that idea. Ted Cruz recommends it, too. Number one, we should allow people to purchase health insurance across state lines. In fact, it's a Republican idea that dates back more than a decade. But is it a good idea? Experts say probably not. In fact, three states already allow interstate sales of insurance, Georgia, Maine, and Wyoming. So does the Affordable Care Act, if all the states involved agree to it. But so far, not a single insurance company has offered to sell a product approved in one state to people in another state. Why not? Because it turns out that selling one state's insurance plan in another state isn't so easy. For one thing, most insurance plans today have specific networks of doctors and hospitals. So if you're in Florida and you want to buy a plan from North Dakota, it's unlikely that North Dakota plan will have many health care options for you in the Sunshine State. Those who support the idea say that people could save money by buying insurance from states that require fewer benefits, particularly expensive benefits like coverage for autism or fertility treatments. But the difference in benefit levels between states has been narrowed because the Affordable Care Act created a more uniform set of benefits most plans have to include. Of course, all the Republican proposals assume the ACA will be repealed. And some still worry about what they call the race to the bottom. That would happen if insurers choose to locate in states with the most lax regulations so they could offer cheaper but also less comprehensive policies. That could draw the healthier people out of their home states, leaving behind sicker people and causing insurance premiums there to rise. That could put consumers on the hook if something happened. And if you buy a policy from another state, who would you call? Your state's insurance regulator doesn't have any power over plans sold in other states. In short, selling insurance across state lines sounds like it would be a good idea, but it hasn't worked so far.